hey dude um, I'm gonna try to make these as quick as possible I'll probably end up making a couple of them just because uh, there are several things that I think are worth discussing before we start to play um, things obviously more important than my my account name but uh, the first thing I wanted to talk to you about is choosing a realm so there aren't nearly as many realms on classic WoW as there is in live WoW like I think in live WoW there's probably 50 or 60 different servers if not more um, I know that a lot of the top streamers are going to this server, this Fairlina. Um, so that might be a really good option because chances are there's going to be a lot of stuff going on. Um, the only downside is if a lot of the top streamers are going to one faction over the other, <laughs> we, we could be dying a lot while playing. But, you know, it is what it is. After kind of like picking a server... Um, looking at whether or not it's a low, medium, or high pop server. If we if we chose to play on a full server, there, there might very well be like a queue time. For sure, for the first week. Um, usually after two or three weeks, the queue times kind of die down. But I've seen queue times everywhere, anywhere from like five minutes to over an hour. And me being somebody who doesn't have a lot of time to play and very specific times to play. Uh, I don't know if, if that would be a good thing to be like, all right, I have 45 minutes to sit down and play with Brian, and there's an hour-long queue. So that would be something to think about. Do you want to be on a server with a bunch of the popular streamers, or do you want to go to like a low-pop server and have no risk of not being able to play? So that's kind of the, the main thing to talk about here in the first video is picking the server. The next thing is going to be to choose a faction. Um, and I'm going to go into the different races in a different video because that'll, that'll take a lot of time. But basically, you know, if you if you did the beta, you know that there's Alliance and Horde. Um, however, once you choose the server, you can only have Horde or you can only have Alliance. So like you and I couldn't play on the same server and have an Alliance character and a Horde character. Um, again, I'll, I'll try to save all of the different uh, races for the next video, but essentially, number one, we need to choose a server. It needs to be a PvP server. Um, and then we kind of need to decide, are we going to go Alliance or Horde? Going back to the server uh, question, um, if like let's say one of the uh, servers has a lot of streamers on it. like let's say we chose to go here and you know they all end up rolling horde and we roll alliance you know we're gonna have no problem finding people when we're out questing to kill however <laughs> if we go the other way and all of the streamers and everybody are going horde and we choose alliance or vice versa we might not find anyone to kill. And I don't know how you like playing your games, but I could really care less about the questing and all that jazz. I just want to find people who are 17-year-olds sitting behind their computers at home and just crying because I killed them over and over and over. 